Assalamu alaikum from Uzbekistan, the capital city of Tashkent. About to embark on a journey that I wasn't really prepared for, but it is what it is. I'm gonna adventure out to the Aral Sea, the desert. We'll see what's next. And yeah, a bit of a, an extreme festival over there. They organize the larger plane, especially for the festival. Usually it's a 60 person plane, but this one I think it's like 250 to 300. That's it. So it's a 45 minute flight and it's gonna be a quick one. Up and down, a lot of ravers. A rave plane. Maybe we'll be raving here. Wow flying there at 7 in the morning. All right, so I just met my first travel friend, Alex, Alexey. Hi guys. He's from Russia, living in uh, Uzbekistan currently. And we're about to embark on this journey to Stihia. He's alone, I'm alone, so maybe we'll be like seeing each other often and drinking and stuff. So this is the, the plan. All the party people are behind me, ready to rave, ready to go to the Never Never Land. Airport of Nukus. It was a short flight, comfortable, met a cool cat on the trip. A peace break in the middle of the fields. I wonder if you've seen this type of things in uh, other countries before, where you can stop in the uh, middle of a field, full bus takes a break. Yes. Now there, now the brake stop. I'm a little bit tipsy at this point. I was sleeping, but expected to go to bathroom in the store but we couldn't find it this is the last road to the festival to the festival grounds to the apartment I'm a little bit tired hungry tipsy I need some water I'm in the front with my homeboy bus driver I mean, it's a good crew here. Long trip, long trip along this road. Ребята, девчата, я очень сопереживаю, что Советский Союз распался и Арал ушел. Мы сейчас приедем туда. Павел вам продемонстрирует дальнейшие действия. Но люди забывают, что эпоха потребления we just arrived in my nook and No comments, bro. No words. Where are we going? What are we doing? Jir, открой еще. Mission accomplished. We just set up the beds in this apartment, in this room. <laughs> We're gonna sleep on uh, mini mattresses that are Uzbek style. Check this out. <laughs> Four people. I haven't done this since, oh my God, 2010, I think. When I used to sleep with like eight people in the room. And we have this window to the desert. So the family that's renting us the apartment invited us to their home. 
little bit outside and they invited us for dinner to eat some pilaf will be interesting to eat so this is pilaf with beef not with lamb usually they serve it with lamb but this time it's with beef I'm not sure for what reasons, but it looks beautiful with some tea, with some company, and we're sitting like this. Very cool. Thank you very much for the wonderful dinner. It was tasty. We just got our bracelets. There's sound check. It's Puma? Yeah, yeah, Puma. Puma. And Austria. Austria. And it's you. Fun. You. Cool, cool man. Cool man. <laughs> cool man. <laughs> We're going to this grave. The shipyard. Да, в дырку, да? Блин, я искренне прошу прощения, что ли? I feel like I'm in a war zone. I'm going to these desert bombs to get into the festival. Good morning from my nook. We completed our first night of the festival. We completed our first night of the festival. It was okay because it was raining. Uh, the crowd was whatever, you know, not Burning Man style as I expected. We got some pictures from the ship graveyard. That was cool. We lost the phone there actually. I asked my friend this friend and she, she threw the phone to me and then uh, it dropped in the in, inside the ship and one of the local dudes went inside I mean through a hole gets the phone I'm paying five bucks for his you know help of course now we're going for breakfast what do you think about last night how was last night uh, I think it was maybe five Five of, of ten. ten. Okay, okay. Wait, wait. So we just ordered breakfast, and this is what they brought us after five hours of cooking. An empty 
Uzbek glasses. <coughs> We're going to pour some beer here. Wow, look at the show number, right? Я, короче, посмотрел, so where are you guys from? You speak English? Where are you from? From Uzbekistan? Yeah, I'm from. Yeah. We're from. Tashkent. is a great alternative. Alternative girls, right? Maybe. For 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 this culture, for this country, I think. Of course. Day two. Как вас зовут? What's your name? Ильор. А? Ильор. Ильор. Nice to meet you. Very cool. This festival is not just for the party, but it's also for a conference where people discuss the different issues surrounding the RLC and the local community as well. Day two at the festival, but it's a raining day once again. Unfortunately, we are. We feel, we feel like chilling today. Not so much excitement and partying. This is the yurt that the people are staying at. It's pretty cool. We have some DJs from Georgia. What's the uh, DJ names? Very cool, very cool, bro. That's shown. Are you guys staying here in the, inside the, the yurt? You sleeping no, here? No, no, no. No, you're staying at the hotel. Just, just chill. Oh, artists there, yeah, yeah. VIP. Yeah. <laughs>
degree at the festival. I'm resting up today. Uh, not enough energy to continue on without any sleep. The friends have left. My chosen family for the festival have left. So I will spend some time walking around, exploring the city, I guess. Football, играете? Yeah, yeah. Hello, America. Как по детски? Не, не очень. Не очень. Учу. Я родился в Ташкенте. Родился, да. Но ехал в Америку, когда маленький. But imagine 40 years ago there used to be water here and then decade by decade it started to disappear because Soviet Union decided to make canals for the farm landing and the cotton production that was taking place here in Uzbekistan and of course with time and global warming the sea started to dry out and disappear. This is the result of this human behavior. Oh, my God.